David Barnson with us this morning. David, I want to talk about your specialty, and that is finding companies and stocks which pay a safe and growing and strong dividend. I'm very interested. Give me some stocks which pay a safe and growing and strong dividend. What do you got? Well, I kind of divided it up this morning into two categories. These companies that are doing really well, that have all this momentum right now. You look at Simon Property Group is up over 100% from its COVID bottom, had big numbers earlier in the week and is on a real tear, and yet is still really down from its all-time highs, yielding 6.5%. They're collecting 90% of rents. This is an operator of shopping malls during the pandemic, but has really high-quality assets, high quality tenants and managing the difficulty extremely well six and a half yield and growing even after all this recovery with Simon property okay. but then I look at some names Stuart that are not doing as well price wise and I think a lot of people are looking at this market saying where can I find some value well look Verizon Merck IBM these companies are not going anywhere they have very strong balance sheets very low leverage they're not the most exciting names in the world but these are high dividends and they're growing from really really well-run companies let me go back to BX Blackstone uh, you yeah. told me about Blackstone at least a year ago I bought it when it was around 32 and it was paying about six percent it's doubled. Thank you very much, David. It has doubled to 71. I've still got it. And now it yields about 3.4 percent, I think, at this new price. You think that yield is you think they're going to pay even more in dividend? The yield goes up from here on Blackstone? I absolutely believe that. And the best news I've heard all day is that Stuart Varney still owns the Blackstone. I told him to buy. That is fantastic. But listen, Stuart, uh, Blackstone pays its dividend from free cash flow. Its free cash flow comes from it being a management company of assets, private equity, real estate. They continue to raise funds hand over fist. They have a great future ahead. Stock prices come up quite a bit, but that dividend is very well protected. A lot of free cash flow. We really like Blackstone quite a bit. I have to follow up by saying that I did buy the Simon Property Group on the basis of its 6 or 7 percent. Uh, uh, I forget what it was yielding, but I bought it when it was way up there in price. I bought it for that strong dividend and it promptly collapsed. Uh, I did sell it, however, so I'm out of that. You want me to get back in, David, real fast? Well, here's, here's what I would say, Stuart, before I give you more personal stock advice. The Simon Property stock collapsed. The dividend did not. They continue paying it throughout the whole period. And at the time you bought it, it probably had about a 4% yield. Yes. And then it went to a 7% yield just because the stock had dropped so much. Now the stock has recovered. It's well, well, well off of the lows. And you have a company that after the financial crisis went up 500 percent in its recovery now look there's different pressures now there's different headwinds around the whole mall industry but they don't own those types of malls that are collapsing all over the country primarily it's very high quality assets they've done a lot to even sell the assets to amazon for fulfillment centers they just have great real estate great locations and yes their cash flows are perfectly protected i'm really impressed with what they're doing through this pandemic okay i may get back in if i do i'll tell you david barnson thanks very much for being here i love that blackstone thank you sir